Hey y'all, it's your girl coming back with another video and this video today will be about um everything that I have used during the month of October and I have just fell in love with it. So the title of this video will be my October favorites. Um <clears throat> these products I have either picked up and used a couple of times or used consistently throughout um the month of October. I'm talking like it's gone already. Damn near gone, but this month. And I wanted to share with you guys these things that I find um, just all around good to use. Um, we'll start with, like, face products, <clears throat> which most of them are about my face. But, I mean, like, um, face wash and stuff that matter. So, um, I've been using Ambi the bar, the cleansing bar for quite some time now and I think the Shea Butter Soap and the black the black soap if I'm not mistaken I believe I've used those and so I picked up the um, Even and Clear Ambi Exfoliating Wash and I like this product the only thing I really don't like about this product is <clears throat> once I wash my face with it it kinda leaves my um, skin kinda dry and that's the only thing I hate. I hate anything that makes my skin kind of dry. But it's just like dry. I guess because of the air or something. I don't know. But after that, I found, I put on this product. And this product is um, Ambi Essentials Daily Moisturizer with SPF 15 protection. It's a light oil free formula. And once I wash, um, I use the bar soap. Then I use that. And then I use this. And my face is just, oh, that was bad. That was a, a blooper. But, um, <laughs> I put that on after the exfoliating wash, and I am fine. I mean, good to go. Um, I have gotten a couple of questions about the and find the airbrush primer that I that I told you guys that I had that I wear. I put on before my foundation. This is it. Don't know how good my camera gonna focus on this thing, but like I told you, it doesn't have a name. It's not by any special person. I picked this up from CVS. Um. I think the price on it is $5 or $5 even or $5.99 or something like that. I told you guys I got them two for $5. I got the, a little brush set or interchangeable brushes. And I, I saw this primer and I picked it up and I just love the finish. I told you guys that this is, I've used this consistently. I love this. And it, it actually lasts a little bit because I had this for quite some time. Um, <clears throat> let me see what else. Uh, lip gloss. I love lip gloss. Um, I'm not really into color lip gloss, but I'm finding a few shades that I like that I picked up along the way. But my all-time, all-time favorite lip gloss. Y'all can look at me like, girl, really? Yes, really. Is this lip gloss right here. And it is by um, LA Colors. And it's just a clear lip gloss. Um, it says glossy lips. It's a... Sheer moisturizing lip gloss. That is all. I promise you. I don't have that on today. But this is my top. I saw it in Family Dollar. I usually get them from Dollar Tree for a whole dollar. But it was in Family Dollar this time for a dollar. And it's actually a bigger too. So I couldn't. I just couldn't just walk past it. Like for real? Really? Yeah. No. I love this stuff. So um, I probably got about three or four tools around my apartment. And um, I absolutely love it. Um, occasionally. I get the most dry, cracked ass lip. That's why if you ever see my video and my lips are like seriously glossy, I try to keep something on them because my lips get so freaking dry. Even with all the water that I drink. But what I found, I've been using this for a couple of months. And um, it is Neosporin Lip Help Daily Hydration Therapy. It's just, that's what I have on my lips right now. And y'all can see it actually look like a gloss, but... It's like a greasy form. It just keeps your lips like really, really moisturized. And I absolutely love this stuff. This goes in my purse every single day. I ain't caught no one without it. I just need to get another one. And I think this one I got from Walgreens. It was like $5.49, $5.50, something like that. And um, it is really good for um, dry lips. With juice. Or if you just want to keep your lips very, very moisturized, that is wonderful. Get that. Use that. I love that stuff. Um... I'm into blushes now a little bit, and I like this one. I got from, I think I showed it to you guys, Black Radiant, and the color is Spice Ginger. It's like a, 
Look at that mirror. It's like a pinkish, reddish color. Mm, let me see. See? If y'all can see that. Probably not, because of my dang on camera. But anyway, I like this one. This is my favorite for October. I've been working this out. Um, my two favorite um, mascaras for this month is... I, it took me a while to get used to this one. It took me a minute to warm up to the uh, the Falsies Volume Express by Maybelline, but I'm starting to like it. I usually use it with the regular Maybelline, and I don't even see it up here. Oh, yes, I do. I use it with um, Maybelline Great Lash. I do this first, then I do this, and it thickens and add a little falsies to it, make it look real nice. Um, this all-time favorite. I love this. I need another one. I really do. And it's just the Lash Stiletto in very black. Lash Stiletto. Love these. All-time favorite, October favorite. Um, let's see, what else? Um, smell good. Perfume. Okay, like I was saying before, my camera just decided to run out of memory. Um, my, fa my favorite fragrance. Favorite fragrance. That was crazy. Favorite fragrance. <laughs> of the month would be Ed Hardy Hearts and Daggers. I absolutely I love this. And every time look at this. I just mm, made me want to spray like right now y'all. It, it really smells good. And it's Hearts and Daggers. And I believe this bottle was either 55 or 65 dollars. Love this I mean, it just, I just opened it and I, it just smells so freaking good. But anyway, it smells real good. Um, nice. I hate dropping stuff. Um, if you, uh, anywhere, and you, you can, you can smell that. You can get a tester. Smell that. I love that. Like, the business. Okay, um, I don't know why I even jumped off lips, but, um, lipsticks. I told you guys I'm not really into color lip glosses, but lipsticks, uh, they warming up to me. And I found this one. It is um, $2.35 by Maybelline Color Sensations, and it is called Warm Me Up. It is a pink. More so, I use it as like a light pink, and it could be like a, a nude, you know what I'm saying, depending on what, what color I line my lips with. Um, this has become a favorite. Um, Toffee Tango. I think I showed you guys Toffee Tango. This is just like a brown. I freaking love this. Coffee Tango. Um, and Nearly There, number 205. It's a nude. I love it. Yep, yep, yep. Love it. Um, LA Colors, I wasn't really into their eyeshadows, but traditional. I picked up this palette. It's like a palette full of naturals. Neut I'm talking about naturals. Neutrals. Love that one. Um, this one is Neutral Shimmers. I hate this one. I can never get it open. Anywho. Natural Shimmers. Neutral Shimmers. And it's called Tea Time. Absolutely love it. And Wet n Wild Vanity. Bam. For the fall, I'm loving this. I'm telling you guys. I absolutely love this stuff. And I picked up... Um, Another Elf All Over Cover Stick from Walgreens, Walmart. It was a dollar, and it was in Honey. It's in Honey, and I use this one for, as an eyeshadow base. So, yeah. That's all I wanted to show you guys. Um, I'll probably try to take some pictures and get these, um, the eyeshadows so you can get real good colors of them. But, yeah, these are just some things I wanted to show you guys. And if y'all want to show me what y'all like it for the month of October, do that. And I have no problem with posting it as a video response. Um, until next time, lovelies, y'all take care. Bye.